Hello everyone, welcome back to another video here. Um, this is going to be a pretty exciting little trip here. Um, I'm actually up north at Lake Erie today, and I'm going to be actually kayaking some of the marshes to hopefully get some wildlife photography photos. Kind of seeking out different subjects today. Um, definitely going to do some like plovers, sandpipers. Um, then you got the waterfowl, of course, like the ducks and the swans. And then hopefully even some of the wading birds like the herons and egrets. Um, so it's kind of really overcast light right now. Um, it just hit sunrise. But um, I think it's going to be just very nice overcast diffused light. Uh, so nothing too exciting, but I think it's going to be a great opportunity to get out there on the water and uh, try something different. And um, I really, I've done this a couple times already before um, with previous trips and it's been really rewarding. Um, you can get lots of different images that have just it's unlocked such a different perspective, um, I feel like, um, compared to being on foot. So. Alrighty, so I uh, got my PFD on, my personal flotation device, um, got the paddle of course, kayaks registered, got everything here, so I'm bringing my 150-600 telephoto lens, that's it, um, no binoculars, um, just because it's just extra gear, and um, yeah, pack some water, pretty much good to go, wearing a wetsuit, um, got wet gloves, socks on, um, the birds are out singing right now for sunrise here, and um, should be a pretty good one, so go ahead and get started here. Launching is always the hardest part for me. All right, so I wrapped up my uh, kayaking trip here for the day. Um, it actually went up pretty well. Um, a little slower than maybe previous trips that weren't obviously recorded or filmed, um, but I did get a variety of different species like I hoped. Um, namely, actually probably the biggest highlight was I got a lifer um, during this kayaking trip, and that was a black tern, um, which is a, of course, a tern species. Um, they're much smaller than common terns or foresters terns. Um, but they usually, they have an all black body and silvery wings. And uh, I have to see, I think about three, maybe four of them um, way out in the marsh there. So that was really cool to see that and to get a lifer, of course, which is, I think, number 229. Other than that, I um, had a, some Dunlins, um, had those. I had uh, some red winged blackbirds. Um, in particular, I think I got some good images of a female um, that looked really nice. Um, got some really good close-ups of a great egret that was actually preening, it looked like. I got a few other different species I saw during my trip. Um, yeah, just lots of different um, birds and stuff. Um, heard some yellow warblers, at least. Um, and um, yeah, it, I think other than that, um, I got a couple images. I'll share them here at the end of the video, of course. And um, hopefully it inspires you to maybe uh, go out and, you know, paddle the waters and see if you can get your own images as well. 